welcome to this video. Today I'm going to be doing it like this. And I just want to show you today we are going to be making this, this clock skirt. So I hope you guys enjoy this. And I just want to show you guys what it looks like right now. This is just the intro. And so we're going to get to the second part of this video. So basically right here I'm just showing you like what it can look like on. Like if you're going to put it on like a person or something. So the next part I'll be making it. So yeah, let's just go all through you. So first thing you'll need is a clear piece of paper, a clean piece of paper, clean white piece of paper. Okay. You're gonna need three pins, and you're gonna need a ruler with about six inches of a line. And then once you have that line, you're gonna draw a second one for six inches, three inches in the middle. And then you're gonna need to cut four little pieces out, like how I am drawing you on here. So I cut it, I'm sorry this piece is a little blurry, but I got it fixed after a while. And so yeah, I'm just showing you guys the four corners that I cut. Sorry if you guys can hear the background, I'm recording in front of a school. Okay, now you're just going to cut around it, all the way around, like I'm showing you. Okay, like this, you're going to cut it, and now you're going to fold it, and like that. Just going to cut it again, and make it completely round, like how I did on here. And I'm just showing you, now I'm going to open it and show you a little bit. Then I'm going to flatten it out. Because you know it needs to be flattened out. And you're going to need to put numbers on these four corners. Like six, like three, six, nine, twelve. And then you're going to need to add some more. Like you need to add the lines and the numbers in between. But this part is optional. Then you need to cut a little piece in the middle. Because you are going to be using that as the skirt part. And then you're going to need a board. You need to fold it. And then once you fold this, I'm sorry this part is shaky. I was holding it with my mouth. You're going to need to fold that part. And you're going to staple that. Sorry the staples are a little off. I was looking through the camera. So... Staple that. Okay, stapling. Okay, never mind. <laughs> I had to redo it because it was so bad. Okay, there you go. That's what it looks like. And then I'm going to do the same to the other side. I had to do this off camera. So I guess it's going to look down right there for a little bit. <coughs> do 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 Okay, here I'm back with my staple. My no, no, I'm not. Okay, here I'm back with my staple. So I stapled it properly the way I wanted it, and so I can show you that. And then you're gonna need the red marker and pin, and you need to, uh, first you need to cut up the little lines. Yes, I forgot about that part. And this is optional too. As I said, a lot of these steps are optional. You don't have to use everything that I did. But you can use it and copy it completely. And then now I'm showing you me doing it better. Okay, keep watching, keep watching. I promise you it does get better after a while. Oh, and I'm not gonna post on Sunday, so this is why I'm posting today. So I just showed you how it looked, and then you're gonna need to fill in dots above your um, numbers, one to 12. Hopefully this is a little bit better for you guys to see on. I didn't know if it was or not. I'm doing a voiceover too, so I don't remember the exact same things that I said in my head while shooting it. You know. So that's almost done. Oh, let's go skip over this part of what I had. You guys would want it.
Hey guys, thank you so much for watching this video. I'm going to make these clock skirts kind of type things. And I can use them. So I'm going to come back when everything is cleaned up. So I'm going to find four, three, two. Here. And I have, ow, I just hit my hand. I have my two skirts. And yeah, I cleaned everything up. At least that wasn't part of my mom's desk. So yeah, it's all cleaned up. And I have my two skirts. This is the first one I made. This one was the second one. And you guys can use any kind of colors you want, personalize them any way you want. That's how I want to do my clocks, skirts, or if you have a person like, person like this, you can make them bell sleeve like that on them.